Good morning, Deer Valley High School, and welcome to Deer Valley High School News. I'm Brody Silverman. First up, what is the deal with all these mattress stores popping up around town? Are people getting more sleepy, or is something else at play? New student Thomas Lambert has the story. I'm standing here in front of the fifth mattress store to open up in Deer Valley this year alone. I don't know about you guys, but I never see anybody in these mattress stores. I reached out to an executive of Mattress Flex, the most popular of these franchises, and he's invited me to his office for an exclusive interview. Here's what I found. Hey there. Sorry, I was in a conference meeting. All right, you ready? Uh, well, I'm Edward Harrington III. Uh, my father is Edward Harrington II, and one day I'm going to be taking over the company from him. Uh, well, the company was started from Edward Harrington I, my grandfather. We have been a dynasty for over 60 years, and uh, we're excited to continue to bring the better sleep for cheap. So what specifically about Deer Valley has drawn you to open so many locations here? That's an amazing question. Uh, but, uh, I don't know, Deer Gro Sorry, uh, can I just... No, 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 all good, all good. Um, do you want to run that again so I have it? Yes, yes, I'd love to. Right. So, um, Deer Valley has just always had a special place in my heart. I just want to make sure that all of them get the better sleep for cheap. Uh, to a new topic, what are your thoughts on the conspiracy theories about the money laundering in all these new mattress buildings? Could you cut that out? What? Just that little bit right there. I don't know if that was a joke, but just could you, could you cut that out? I, I didn't mean to offend you. If I, no, if I offended you, I'd like to just... Okay. Uh, sorry. That was, that was rude of me. Just, um, I really don't want that out there, so could you just make sure you don't? I'm sorry? I apologize. It's all right. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I, that was, no, I'm sorry. I just, uh, something. Woo. Um, yeah, uh, my father would not let you leave with that camera if you say that, so I just, I cannot let you leave with that camera. What so are you talking about? You can either just give me the camera or I'm just going to take it. Um, I think, I think we're done here. Okay, all right. I didn't want to do this. Hey, sir, how are you doing? Yeah, it wasn't too difficult. I got him right in front of me. Oh my god, I forgot to tie him to the chair. Where are you going? But seriously, hey, hey, that was quite the performance back there. I mean, well, uh, uh, I wouldn't do that. That's not how, you know, a hostile situation works. Um, okay, so you have evidence. Not physical evidence, I destroyed your little camera or whatever. But um, if you leave this place and tell people about what I did or what you think you saw, we're gonna have problems. I mean, you're trying to label our family like we were a bunch of criminals. You are criminals. Yeah, but I don't like that word. Um, but here's the deal. You're going to do justice to the Harrington family name by wearing it for the rest of your life. What are you gonna do to me? Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Deer Valley High School News. I'm Brody Silverman. First up, what is the deal with yet another mattress flex opening up in our town? We decided to interview the new owner of the store following Thomas Lambert's mysterious disappearance after investigating this story last week. Our very own Will Fisher has the story. Sorry I'm late, I was caught in a business meeting. Edward Harrington IV, nice to meet you. 